Welcome everybody, I'm Robbie Straczynski. And I'm Shimmy the Fish. And we are here again at PokerUpdate.com to bring you a special segment called Poker Doppelgangers. Yay, something new. Yeah, we're only going to do it one time. Oh. Alright, maybe another time. Yay! Okay, so what we're going to do, basically we're going to take some poker players that you know, or Shimmy may know, uh, and we're going to display their picture on the screen and we're going to say, who do they look like from the world of celebrities and that sort of stuff? Who would you say I look like? Uh, you look like Shimmy the Fish. I mean, like, I, anyone looks at you and like, fish, Pfft. hello, no? Okay, who, well... <laughs> Shimmy the Fish with a beard? I don't I, know. I am Jack Sparrow. I am very clearly Captain Jack Sparrow. I could see that. Maybe. There you go. Not really. Without the accent, <laughs> without the talent, I mean, something I don't know. Allow me like. to lend a machete to your, uh, to your intellectual thicket. On to the real poker doppelganger. So, Shimmy, we're gonna throw out a first poker pro for you. What Go do you for it. Think? What are we doing? Uh, we talked a lot about poker pro. He's in the poker world. He's the editor of Pocket Fives, Lance Bradley. All right, so Shim, who do you think uh, Lance Bradley looks like? That's Interesting very guy. clearly Dwight from The Office. Dwight? Dwight oh, from The Office. Interesting. No? Come on, I mean, that's I can, a little bit I can close. see Brazil with the horn rimmed glasses. I yeah. see that. I see that. We like this. That's not really Michael! Everything. <laughs> no, oh, I see what you're doing. Very good, right. Actually, we were thinking he looks a little bit more like Drew Carey. Wow. I see that. Right? That's well done. Right. What do you guys think? I see the resemblance. Okay. All right. I, I, I accept. Okay, good. Bring on the next one. Next doppelganger. Who do we have here for? Ah, okay. Let's display Olivier Bousquet. So, Shimmy, Olivier Bousquet, who do you think he looks like? All right, this one I actually really like. You ready for this? Yeah. I would say from, uh, what's his name, from Runaway Jury, um, John Cusack. Oh. Come on, that's good. But you need, to put on, you need to put on, like, a beard or something, well, right? He has that's a beard. Right. Most of the time he is. But, like, John Cusack's very pale. Okay. Well, Olivier's not so pale. I would say he looks a little bit more like Ryder Strong from Boy Meets World. Remember that guy? I have. Right? Been, yeah. Okay. Yeah, take a look. Ryder Strong, what do you think? No. All right, there you go. I still say John. Oh, come on with John Cusack, come on, baby. Olivier did shave his hair, and so did uh, Ryder, I think. But when they had the whole thing, hair thing going, I mean, hello, they're like, one and the same. All right, let's go. Bring up the next one. This is fun. I like this segment. Okay. We're going to go to do this often. The one, the only, Phil Hellmuth. I got this straight up. No question, okay, all right? right? You don't even, right, no, 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 right. no, 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 no. Put it, no. Ready? Hands down. No question. We're talking about George Costanza from Seinfeld. <laughs> Absolutely, I there it is. is. But Shimmy, did you take a close look at the picture? You notice like the uh, the Caesar costume that Phil has you there? Okay. Very, very Hold easy. Hold on one sec. Hold Think on. Go on. If I'm going to throw out a second guess, Vizini from Princess Bride. <laughs> Come on, baby. S certainly. No. I can see what you're doing there, but we were no? thinking, you know, from the Gladiator, Joaquin Phoenix. Inconceivable. When, when he show, when he's got. Oh, Inconceivable. Oh, I see what you did. Very good. Right. Very good. You like right. that? Yeah, but I'd say that Joaquin Phoenix. All right. Gladiator with when when he I had see, that when yeah, he I walked into the saying. WSOP with the Caesars uh, costume there. I mean, like it's, it, it's okay, obvious from Gladiator. All right. All right. Well we got done. one more. Well we got two more actually. Well, let's go. Next All one. All right. Up. We all know him as the Unabomber, <gasps> Phil Locke. Take a look at Phil Locke. Phil Locke. Phil, all right, Phil, Phil Locke. Locke. Who does Phil Locke look Phil like? Phil Locke is one of my favorite players, I gotta tell you. Love you, Phil Locke. I'm gonna have to go with Ed Norton. Bring on Ed Norton. Specifically, we're gonna go with Hulk and Norton, even though the movie's terrible. Oh, Sorry, Ed. Or we're gonna go with, you know, uh, from Rounders. Let's do Ed Norton. No, see, that's Come the on. thing. I hear you. I'm okay, like, one second, one second. No, it's, no, not, it's not that there's a right or no, wrong. No, you know? you're misunderstanding. You need a picture of Ed Norton with a hood over his head. And it's, ah, there you go. Maybe. No? The, the thing is, Ed Norton and Rounders is always so closely associated with Negreanu. I mean, you know, that's like it's like uh, the one in the same here. We were thinking more, you know that character, as you mentioned, from The Office? Remember Toby Flanderson? Toby Bird. Right? Bird. Look Whoa. at that picture. Look at that. No. Oh, up, like I'm sorry. This is the perfect point to put up the gif of Michael Scott. No! <laughs> no! I refuse. No, absolutely not. To no, 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 no. Unibomber cannot be Toby. Toby. No, 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 no. Eh. Absolutely not. All right. On Next to our one. final, our final uh, doppelganger. How about Scott Siever? Take a look. Okay. All right, Shim. Who's the last guest? Who do you think he looks like? It's straight up. If you, uh, you just looking at the picture, if I didn't know who that was, I would say it's Chris Pratt. Who? Chris Pratt. No. Dude, you don't know no. who Chris Pratt is? Yes, I know who he is. Okay, so first of all, no, no, no. I'm talking about Chris Pratt from Parks and Rec before he lost all that weight for, Guardian, uh, for uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. I hear you. Absolutely, no. Chris Pratt. No. Just picture no. that. No. Yeah. No. Well, who do you, you know? Who he really looks. Oh, shit, and you're going to be kicking yourself. 
Jonah Hill. Hello! Take a look at that. No. Jonah Hill, man. No, Chris it's Pratt. What? It's like they were separated. Chris Pratt, birth. I'm shouting out to you, baby. I found your doppelganger on Doppelganger Week. I want to see your Facebook profile. Switch <laughs> to this person because you know you need to change your Facebook profile to that of a celebrity. Well, we hope that you've enjoyed this special episode of Poker Doppelgangers. You can enjoy during Doppelganger Week or any other week, just like all the great episodes and videos of all the other stuff we do here at PokerUpdate.com. I'm Robbie Straczynski. And I'm Shimmy the Fish. See you next time.